And welcome, welcome on this usual Red Dead Online holiday, not holiday, weekend stream. Um, yeah, each each weekend I'm trying to make a Red Dead Online stream, you know, mostly to talk with people, to read chat and stuff like that. But today we're gonna be doing something a little bit different at, on the background, because usually I just talk during the stream. But uh, on the background, like collecting something. But today is gonna be different than since you kind of saw title, you know exactly what. What I'm gonna be doing uh, on the background. Anyway, hello to everyone who already joined and thanks to everyone who already placed a like. I see a lot of familiar nicknames, Caro UK, Pro88, uh, Penny. Bold Arthur Morgan. Actually, it's not a familiar. <laughs> it's not a familiar nickname. But anyway, hello and welcome. Giga Chad says hello. Hello, Giga Chad. And uh, do you have Twitch cat? Uh, DC asks. No, I don't. Actually, I have, but I don't make any streams there. So anyway, guys, hello, welcome. Uh, so in case you didn't guess, like I'm gonna be dragging sedated sleeping basically alligator from lagra to tumbleweed and the background and i'm gonna focus on chat so reading uh your comments uh, having a discussion we already have 137 viewers 59 likes again it's pretty cool that even before stream people are placing likes and yeah thanks to everyone who placed a like and thanks to all my patreon supporters you can see the nicknames on your stream as always anyway can you see my beans mary says no <laughs> uh, so first of all we're gonna find an alligator I guess we're gonna find an alligator here because from from here it seems like it's the closest uh, road to to tumbleweed. I mean, oh, oh, we can make anyway. Let's take uh, alligator here, right in front of Harriet, because who cares about Harriet? Steven Carnes says, "Hey, cat, can I get a shout out? Love as a content very helpful." Uh, I'm not quite sure if I'm reading the chat out correctly, but anyway, I just I just did. I just made it. Maybe it's shout out. Coma cat says hello, yo cat. No, heck, hi cat. Hi. So for step number one, finding an alligator. Oh, there we go. There we go. Here you are, buddy. Okay, so no, wait, 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 wait. I need to check if that's a sedative I ammo. Because otherwise I'm just gonna kill this alligator. And he's gonna die like in pain because, you know, regular ammo. Yes, yes, yes. So, now. Now we need to wait for alligator to fall asleep. I oh no, it's so far from... Uh-oh, it's not good. Not good at all. I just bought Red Dead Redemption 2, says Glow. Well, congratulations. Red Dead Redemption 2 is like a... It's a masterpiece. No! Run! Run! Drink tonic. Okay, as you can see, it's not that easy. So, you know what, alligators. Here you go. Yeah. Don't mess with me. Uh oh. Do you play on PC? No, I'm play. Uh, I'm playing on Xbox Series X. Okay. Not again. Run, run. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I know it's not going. You know, according to plan. Okay, so. Okay, we, we, we need to find another alligator. One, two, three, four, five, six. Usually six is enough, and now catch him. 
Don't go around. Do you like alligators in real life? Not, not really. I mean, maybe eating alligators. I don't know. And I need, I need to call my horse. Otherwise, I will have to, you know, press uh, the stick all the time. The gators are funny, indeed. Funny indeed. Will you be doing more GTA 5 online videos? Yes, I actually wa I'm actually working on one GTA Online 5 uh, GTA 5 online video at the moment. You know, tips, tricks, stuff like that. Where is my horse? Uh, Mary asks. Where the horse at? Yeah, horses are kind of afraid of alligators for for obvious reason. So my horse just ran away. Anyway, now we are ready to start. And you know what? When you drag in a sleeping animal, and trust me, I did it quite a lot more than I should probably. Anyway, when you drag sleeping animal in Red Dead Online, you need to go pretty slow. Otherwise, otherwise animal just dies. So be careful. Troy says alligators are the only living dinosaurs. Kinda? Oh, no, 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 not again. So, the plan is... Okay, first of all, the, the plan is, is to make a stream on which I'm gonna be... You know, was always communicating, uh, reading chat and stuff like that, but... Nah! Oh, no, step alligator! I'm stuck! <laughs> it's not sorry sorry for inappropriate jokes but you know it's hey bro not not going a <laughs> 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 it's on the tree now. <laughs> it's a flying alligator. Hello, cat, says Antubis. Hello, Antubis. Uh, Mary says, hey, mister, do you have a girlfriend? Yes, but don't tell my wife, please. Just, you know, don't do it. Good afternoon, cat from Portugal. Leroy90 says. Good afternoon. That is a spider, says Gap. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's a it's a alligator spider. Okay, guys, we we gonna do it. Don't worry, we gonna make it. Now, now it's gonna from now it's gonna be easier. From now it's gonna be much easier and smoother. Okay, so let's go. And here we go. Flexing all the way through Tumbleweed. And meanwhile, while I'm gonna be dragging alligator... And yeah, there is another actually, uh, another thing actually. You need to look at your uh, alligator or other animal, sleeping animal that you're dragging. Because you know what? For some reason, if you're not looking at... At the, at the animal, it might disappear. I'm, I'm not kidding, it happened to me like a few times. Y you're just dragging an animal and then boom, it, there is no animal, no corpse, nothing, it just disappeared. Your pet alligator, lol. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's kind of alligator. Anyway, you know what I thought. It's kind of not cool that there are no alligators in Tumbleweed, so I guess I should go. Oh, Co Cowboy Bebop is showing you how to how to use this beans system. Okay, unfortunately. Yeah. My hotkeys are working, so remember, no likes, no Tahiti. How much money you have right now in Red Dead Online? 95, so around now 95,000 on Xbox uh, Series X and uh, uh, 600 gold bars. Uh, so it's, you know, unnecessary answer, like 
normal answer would be more than I can ever spend. <laughs> I like how this guy's like, I'm warning you, I will kill you. No, please don't kill me. I'm just a dude who's dragging an alligator. Like, why? Why would you kill me? Okay, we can go a little bit faster, but just a little bit. Like this. Okay, so I hope the alligator is not gonna die. Anyway, uh, at the background, you gonna see all this beautiful nature of Red Dead and Lions world. Alligator, me, in a pretty weird costume. And uh, let's focus on chat. Arashi says, I've made 1.1 million and 4,000 gold bars. Well, that's... That's the spirit. Definitely some serious level of dedication. Unfortunately, just like me, you know, even more than me. But anyway, pretty much the same. We are in the same situation. Not me, n neither me nor you will be ever able to spend all that money. Well, 231 person is viewing the stream now. Welcome. Hello. We just... Uh, you know, casually go in with alligator to to tumble with. If you go in with alligator, if you go in to armadillo, wish you to wear. Alligator in your hand. Sorry for terrible singing, I do it sometimes. Um, anyway, uh, Bertz says, I'm level 392. Congratulations. Actually, my both my characters are somewhere around. Somewhere around. At this level. What is your favorite movie or TV show? You know, it's kind of hard to answer, like, because there are a lot of favorite movies and TV shows. Like, it's, it's a big list. Sup, says Supra Tard. Sup. Geb says, I'm level 129 and I started three weeks ago, lol. Well, actually, it's, a, it's I would say it's a pretty, pretty good, uh, you know, temp. Y you reached level 129 definitely much faster than most. No, don't shoot me. Like, why is I also so mad about people wearing alligator, uh, dragging alligators? I have no idea. Like, every NPC is trying to to aim a weapon on me. What's your favorite weapon in the game? Ox Wagon asks. Uh, well, let me actually make this. Uh, well, it's definitely Carcana. And uh, it's, you know, if you would ask, like, what is the best weapon in the game, I will answer the same. The Gooseman says, can I join? Do you have an alligator? Because if you don't, well, sorry, this party is only for people with alligators. Miguel Soria says, love your content, boa. Thank you. Uh, anyway, so during the stream, uh, I planned not only to drag the alligator, but also discuss, uh, you know, what happened in Red Dead Online, which is nothing. But around Red Dead Online, some news were received, some stuff. Unfortunately, you know, Rockstar, uh, with Red Dead Online news, it looks like every time there is some reason to hype at least a little bit. Rockstar tries to fix it as soon as possible. It just like happened with update to QA beta DLC pack. Same happened with Shao Zelnik saying something that obviously looked like, you know, a confirmation of the fact that Rockstar is not abandoning Red Dead Online. But then it's just, oh, no, 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 don't, 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 uh, you know, have your hopes uh, too high. 
Okay, so it's Rizal 876S. I like bolt action rifle and the bow. I like the bow as well. How do I level fast in Red Dead Online? Bagelman asks. Well, there is a video on my channel and actually it's called exactly like that. How to level up fast in Red Dead Online. But now, you know, short answer will be would be like uh, use collector roll and uh, turn off uh, auto aim. So you need to have a free aim and it will give you a lot of additional experience, especially if you plan on a PC. I mean, you still don't have uh, auto aim if you play and push mouse in a keyboard, sorry, not on a PC because you can play on a PC with uh, controller as well. How do you personally deal with trolls in Red Dead Online? I don't know what, what troll. I don't meet too many, uh, too many trolls actually. Sometimes there are, but you know you can if you don't want to deal with them, just switch uh, lobby and so, that's it. Randy Page says 3 aim is actually fun, even though I'm a dreadful shot. Yeah, 3M is definitely fun and I mean it gives you like different kind of experience Especially if you're not gonna use uh, painted black because uh, <clears throat> You know when it, especially on a PC when you're using painted black because a lot of people say oh like uh, I have a free aim I'm, I'm superior that everyone else I guess but using <laughs> Painted black at the same time and I mean especially on a PC painted black Plus mouse is more powerful than auto aim actually. Tmart TV joins and says, "How do you do, everyone? Hello, welcome." So you see, uh, such a beautiful, beautiful open world, and we and we just slowly going to tumble with because that's where. Uh, alligator belongs. Are you hyped for Starfield coming next year? You mean, am I hyped for Starfield being delayed? Uh, I'm not quite sure if if we can say, you know, put it that way. Do you think slippery builds are good in PvP right now? Depends. If you're playing on a PC, uh, no. But if you're playing on a console, I would say yes. Because, you know, uh, from from what I saw, I'm not often joining PvP. For the last few years, actually. Because I got really disappointed in Red Dead Online's PvP. But anyway, when I join, and it's not a hardcore series. Because I play hardcore series time to time. But, like, regular sh showdowns almost never. But anyway, when I joined... I, th I saw that quite a lot of people are using this painted black plus Lancaster plus mouse or headshot strategy. And against such players, Slippery Busted is still good. It's, it's, it's actually good. On a, on a PC, I don't really suggest you to use it. Uh, just because too many snipers, which is obvious. So, I don't... Th I mean, it depends, anyway. Hey, Cat, you uh, PC or Xbox? Brian Alfonso asks. I'm on Xbox Series X. Okay, so we go into... Well, uh, well, if you just joined and you have no idea what is going on, I'm just giving this nice, uh, friendly alligator uh, a right to tumble with. Hazard Au says, Hey Cat, a new line of code got added in the latest patch about the castle wrestling mission. What do you think about it? Uh, unfortunately, it turned out that it's not a new code. It was, uh, you know... It was in a game for a long time. It's not something that was in a game, you know, in beta. So it was added 
somewhere between beta and uh, last patch, but not in the last patch. Okay, we are going. We are going. Which other games do you play, Cat? I'm I'm playing uh, um, Call of Duty. I played yesterday Call of Duty. I'm playing GTA RP. I'm playing GTA Online. Uh, but most of the time during last few months, I was playing uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 Story. I replayed some missions. And I, I have a second playthrough on a, on a PC and I, you know, I play like not hurrying up at all. Like focusing on, on the side dialogues, uh, in a camp, spending time and stuff like that. Why not put this alligator on a wagon? Because it's kind of hard to do, even if he's sleeping. I mean, you cannot pick up an alligator, okay, when he, when it's sleeping. So you need to use a lasso, you need to find... Uh, uh, you need to find a special place. It's not that hard, but the biggest problem with this plan is if you're not having a lasso on a sleeping animal, it will wake up and will just run away from your wagon. And uh, so, so you, you know, it might take even more time. Gold Videos asks, how do I get more followers? I have a few subscribers. Well, do something that people will be willing to watch, I guess. NPC is following, yeah, <laughs> suffice to say, exactly, he's, he's like, he, oh, oh, it's weird, but I'm gonna follow. Randy Page says, beware the take two and rockstar stream sniping wolves get, they attacked you yesterday. Yeah, <laughs> during, uh, during video recording, I really was attacked by wolves, and actually, at the, uh, yesterday when I was recording this video, I just cut it out, but I should have, you know, left it. Uh, because before, at the very beginning, when I sa was saying first phrase, I was attacked by a cougar <laughs> and killed. And, and later I was attacked by wolves. What's your favorite thing in Red Dead Redemption 2? Open world. Yeah, open world. It's on, on the first place. Same for Red Dead Online, you know, because they share uh, the same beautiful open world. Oh, nice. We have uh, 265 viewers now. And 177 likes already. Thank you for placing a like. Let's see. We have this beans system on my streams, basically it's just like a points uh, to show stickers. Cat, what are your thoughts on The Witcher 3? This gaming YouTube says, well, it's a masterpiece. In my opinion, Witcher 3 is a masterpiece. I'm not gonna give an answer to the question, which game in your opinion is the best, Witcher 3 or Red Dead Redemption 2? Because, you know, again, it's kind of hard to compare. It's a little bit different experience. But, you know, both are definitely my favorites. I'm gonna say it like this. Cowboy Bebop. Thank you for using Super Chat. Oh, it's not Super Chat. It's a Super Sticker. And uh, it's... Uh, it's a leveling up gaming controller. Thanks. And uh, talking about Witcher 3, I, I played this game when it was released and I was like... Uh, I was super excited about this game. And you know what? It's kind of interesting story, but I, I almost started a YouTube channel back then. Because while I was playing, and you know me, I, I always try to figure out some builds and stuff like that. 
I occasionally found like ultimate game breaking build. Uh, so I was like super easily destroying en enemies much much higher than me and I, I played it on the maximum difficulty so it was not that easy but you know with that build it was just like piece of cake. And I wanted to make a video about this build because I googled, I haven't found anything and I, but then I thought, ah, oh, nah, not, not gonna do it, so, meh. And uh, that's how I haven't started a YouTube channel back then. Okay, another NPC is following me, like, so weird. Uh, but do Malma says, when is the big st next big update? Uh, we have no idea about the next big update, when it's gonna be, what it's gonna be, e even we don't know for sure if it's gonna be a next big update in Red Dead Online. So, sorry, no information. Uh, so, Tmart TV says, what inspired you to do YouTube Rockstar based content? Actually, I started to make videos about Elder Scrolls Online a few months before um, before Rockstar released Red Dead Redemption 2. What inspired me? I don't know, actually. I don't really have a clear answer, but I just thought that it I found an interest. I, I found a pretty cool build in Elder Scrolls Online PvP, and it was like super easy. First places every pretty much every single uh, showdown. It's not. A, it's called Battlegrounds, I believe, in R Elder Scrolls. But anyway, it was like super easy build for that type of PvP, and I decided to share it. I'm I'm pretty sure it's still on a channel. You can go and check how terrible it is, <laughs> because everything's there. Sound, my accent, what I'm saying, montage is just is just terrible. But I mean. Le uh, you know, live to learn. Practice makes it perfect. Yeah, it's it's better. It's better. Uh, God of War is on PC too. Mary says, "Yeah, maybe actually I will. I will, I, I was thinking about buying God of War." Mike Dunn says, "Hello, cat. Hello, everyone. Hello, Mike." And yeah, hello everyone, just in case if you just joined, what we are doing here is, as always on weekends, uh, having a small conversation. And also I'm trying to, you know, deliver this alligator to Tumbleweed and apparently this NPC is helping me. I mean, look, he's, he's trying to help. <laughs> Gaming Brick says, I bought Red Dead Redemption 2 soundtrack on vinyl and it sounds amazing. Yeah, Red Dead Redemption 2 soundtrack is awesome. But again, my personal opinion, Red Dead Redemption 1 soundtrack is even better. At least like in my taste. Both, again, both are great. But let's say if I had, I don't know how much. Ten dollars uh, with me, and I had to choose which soundtrack I have to buy because ten dollars is not enough to buy both. I would buy a soundtrack for the first one. It's just it has completely different vibes, in my opinion. Total Master says, I like to listen to Red Dead Redemption 1 soundtrack while playing online. I, I understand why. Uh, actually, usually, you know, when I play Red Dead Online, I'm either listening to music or to, uh, uh, to podcasts. Some podcasts, stuff like that. And, well, have you mentioned that my horse looks tired? Like, really? It looks like it's gonna die soon. Oh, I guess I need to feed it. But I'm not gonna do it because I'm afraid that NPC is gonna steal my alligator. 
Suffice to say, it says, indeed, ever watched the movie The Hateful Eight? Obviously, I did. I mean, I watched pretty much every single Western that was not every single, but every single, let's say, you know, triple A Western movie, big budget Western movie that was released probably ever. I love Western movies, I mean. Your horse is dragging a dinosaur. Well, good point, good point. Drifter Kid says, hey cat, hey Drifter. Okay. Horse is waiting for Red Dead Redemption to update, yeah. That's why, <laughs> that's why Horse is so unhappy. Okay. Your face when you are waiting for Red Dead Redemption to update. Gaming Brick says that original Django is a very good low budget spaghetti western with a classic soundtrack. I never seen actually original Django. I seen original uh Magnificent Seven. It's called Magnificent Seven, right? Yeah. And remake and both are pretty cool. Both are pretty cool. Okay, le let's feed the horse because otherwise, you know, it, it really looks like it's not gonna make it. Now we need to make it super fast because alligator will wake up. You know, if If too long without a lasso, alligator wokes up. A anyway, it doesn't look like it was related to uh, feeding a horse. It still doesn't look healthy. But anyway. Oh, now, it now it's fine. Now it's fine. Guys, don't shoot me. I'm just... I'm just... Dragon and alligator to tumble with, okay? Hey cat, is Nekadochi's saddle still the best? I'm saving for it. Yes, it's still the best. And I'm gonna tell you more. It's, it will be the best uh, forever. Because it's broken. While making saddles, Rockstar messed up. They basically... I have a theory how it happens. I obviously don't work uh, for Rockstar, so I don't know. But they were uh, moving Nakadochi's saddle from one category of saddles to another. And during that, they forget to change one parameter. Uh, it's, it's just a mistake. That's why Nakadochi's saddle is actually unique. It has stamina drain rate from the saddle. And just like, you, uh, you know, there are like special saddles. And you can install steel wraps on it, just like on regular saddles. And these two uh, parameters stack up. It's, it's only saddles that has this uh, feature. It's not a feature, obviously, it's just a mistake, but, you know. So, uh, they messed up, and that's why Nekadochus is so cool. Let's go, let's go. Continue. Dragon and alligator. Hey cat, on your opinion, what do you think we can expect on upcoming Red Dead Online Summer Update? First of all, Luis, there is no upcoming Red Dead Online Summer Update. We don't have like any sort of a real information, unfortunately, about upcoming update in Red. So maybe there is an upcoming Red Dead Online update in summer, but we don't know about it. Okay, so we cannot tell that there is something, and uh, and therefore the question about what we can expect makes no sense. But what we can expect <laughs> is disappointment. I don't know. <laughs> What else? Hey cat, Gap says, uh, shall I get Moonshiner on Naturalist roll? I'm poor on gold. If you're poor on gold, I mean, not only in, in that case, in any way, in any case, uh, just pick Moonshiner roll. It's much better. Okay, again, 
These NPCs are really unfriendly to people with alligators. Omar says, take the alligator to the mountains in the snow instead. I, I actually already did it a few years ago. I took a sleeping alligator to the Mount Hagen. And even more, I was doing it uh, on my feet, not mounted, just because, you know, it looks better. Rockstar Skywalker Gaming says, NPC are probably jealous. Definitely they are. Because I have an alligator and they don't. And it's a pretty cool alligator, I mean, look. Let's go. Drifter Kid says, I don't want to lose faith, but yay, it doesn't look good. Yeah, unfortunately it doesn't. And again, we had few news uh, in the recent weeks, like promising news. Not even promising news, but like, you know, news that were, were making me say like, yeah, we gonna get an update. Uh, because QA Beta DLC pack was updated and Strauss Zelnik said, yes, it was our plan to support Red Dead Online all, 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 all the way. But as soon as, you know, I was making a video, a, a, be, you know, being excited for this news, pretty soon they rolled it back. Like, really. Oh, Purple Haze uses Super Chat. Th thank you for supporting as a channel uh, and the question is uh, have you ever seen the mini series lonesome dove uh, it's the best western in my opinion no actually i never seen it I, w I will i will check for it ne never even heard about it thanks for sharing It's not like a movie, but not uh, some uh, big, uh, you know, serious eyes. Uh. Tombstone, uh, Tombstone is my favorite Western. Do you like it? Yes. And you know what? Arthur is, it's not like the same character as Doc Holliday, but, okay, they have different personalities, but... Uh, in a way, it was based on Doc Holiday because of TB, you know, and stuff like that. Ancestry, Ancestrius, Ancestrius asks: Is the prestigious bounty hunter license worth it? Uh, yes. Yes, uh, prestigious bounty hunter license makes bounty hunter role cool. Without it, it's it's not you know the best role in my opinion. Uh, but with it, it's it's a different story. Have you watched the good, the bad, and the ugly? Obviously, yes. I mean. Who, who haven't, hasn't. Bravo116 asks, Hey cat, did you ask that alligator if you could drag him to tumbleweed? Of course I did. Of course. Why are you kidding me? Rockstar CEO, don't you lose faith me one more time and we we'll leave. Well, actually, uh, Rockstar CEO, it's not Rockstar, it's uh, Take-Two CEO, sorry. Uh, he, he definitely said some promising news. Uh-oh, seems like I'm, I'm untucked. Oh, no, no. Stupid wolves. And yeah, people were warned. Yeah, wolves really attacked me. Okay, so before alligator woke up, we need to catch him again. So, 
Easy. Stream sniping wolves. Yeah, Randy. Yeah. And I knew, I knew, and you knew that they will show up. And here they are. Anyway, uh, take two, CEO Strauss Zelnik said really promising news, uh, really promising things. First, we, he acknowledged uh, Save Red Dead Online movement, which again, I, I'm still surprised by that. And second, he said about that, you know, it always was a plan to support Red Dead Online. And then, but in a few hours, they've made a clarification that he was talking about Red Dead Online servers, but I mean, it makes no sense because Red Dead Redemption 1 Online is still here, is still working, and uh, it's peer to peer connection. It's not like there are too many servers. So, yeah. I'm pretty sure he made this clarification because he said something that he shouldn't have. It's not, you know, it's not his responsibility to even talk about updates. Hey Cat, have you seen 1883? It's a, it's a new series, uh, I haven't seen it yet. Giga Chat says, Rockstar, we have a plan, we just need more money. I, I, you know, I actually doubt if they really need more money. They have so much money from GTA Online that if uh, they had at least some sort of a plan, well, it would be a different story. Bricks, uh, Bricks asks, is this game ever going to get a real update PvP kit? We don't know. What I can tell is, if this game is not gonna receive any sort of a real update this year, any sort of update at all this year, uh, we will never see any updates in general, so in the future. It's gonna be dead. So, like, probably not even this year, but specifically this summer is like the last, the last chance for Red Dead Online. Unfortunately. So we are going slowly but going. Mike done also testing uh, how these stickers work. And as you can see, they work pretty fine. Hell on Wheels series is brutal with strange characters. A red skin says, I actually watched uh, Hell on Wheels first season. Uh... Again, I was I was not impressed. I just watched it because I love westerns, and in my opinion, like I don't remember TV series about westerns that actually impressed me. Only movies. I don't know why. Maybe there was some TV series, but I. I'm not quite sure. Winnable seven two three says interesting point. By the way, I gave I give them until mid August uh, to call this game dead. Yeah, I would agree with uh, with you know these dates, pretty much. August is like borderline. Caro UK, thank you. For using super chat. Uh, can you get him on a canoe <laughs> and row him out to a bigger boat sometime? Or would he disappear? Actually, it's an interesting question. You know, I, ne I never tried to get a uh, sedated animal on a canoe. Uh, it's an interesting. I, I should try it. I will try it later. I don't know. But... Uh, you see, the problem again is, if you, you need two people at least uh, to, uh, to get to the bigger board. Because if you, you let's say, even if you can get uh, this uh, sleeping animal to a canoe or maybe to some board with a, it's a small steam board, yeah. But you need to somehow control canoe or board. And have a lasso on an alligator. Otherwise, it will wake up. So, 
Uh, but I will test it. I will test it. Gaming Brick says, try that next time, cat. This could work. Yeah, it definitely could work. I mean, especially, you know, maybe not a canoe, but uh, the small steam boats is a better choice because they, they are bigger. So uh, it's, it's actually possible. Hey, cat, which repeater is better than Lancaster? No. There is no such repeater that is better than Lancaster. Because L Lancaster is just better than in everything. Randy Page says the predators sleep approximately one minute. I I never measured time, but I would say less, and even more. Uh, no, actually, if you just sedated an animal. And just leave it. It seems like it sleeps for one minute. But let's say you sedated an uh, animal like an alligator and you drag it. If you will remove lasso, it will wake up much faster than in one minute. Seems like random time, but I would say 20 to 30 seconds. Would it be possible to put the alligator on the wagon to travel faster? Uh, I tried, but again, the problem is they run away. Without lasso, they just run away. What's the best way to make money in Red Dead Online? It doesn't need to be easy because I need money. Uh, it doesn't need to be easy. Well, collector role plus interactive map for Red Dead Online Collector Roll. Google for it. It's also called Gene Robke's map. And just go get full collectibles, full sets. It's, uh, it's... Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the best way of making money. If you if you're talking about like dollars, okay, if you're talking about gold, there are other ways, and the best one is uh, daily challenges, treasure maps. Don't ignore them, and call to arms with a full posse. Naz says, a few days ago my friend showed me how to skin and then revive a sedated alligator. It was the funniest thing. Yeah, there is such bug. It, it looks creepy. It really looks creepy. Can you take an alligator on a train with lasso? Yes, you can. You can. Unfortunately, you know, the problem with trains is that they don't, they don't go anywhere. So, I mean, you, you're gonna waste more time uh, on getting alligator on the train and then getting it off the train and going from the train station than, you know, by just going directly. But with boat, uh, it's actually an interesting idea. 348 people watching. Hello and welcome. Just in case, uh, we are trying to get this beautiful alligator to beautiful city of Tumbleweed. And you might say, well, cat, it's stupid. You are wasting your time. Look at this beautiful sun. I like... Weather, weather effects in, in Red Dead Redemption 2 and Red Dead Online are just amazing. Anyway, you might say, well, cat, it's a stupid idea. You're wasting your time. But you know what is even more stupid? To go and grind uh, horse races with quadruple payout. That's stupid. <laughs> That's a waste of time. And unfortunately, Rockstar thinks that, you know, for five weeks, five weeks... People will be happy to go for horse racing. 
I, I, <laughs> so you know what? It's not, it's not just my opinion. I was making it's already some socia, uh, sociology. I hope it's pronounced like sociology uh, in English. Anyway, there is some science behind what I'm going to say now. But people, players of Red Dead Online, hate horse races in this game. They hate it for different reasons. First of all, I don't know if you mentioned or not, but all horses are the same in, in races. I mean, like, say, in free roams there is not big of a difference, but in, in races they were, like, completely the same. Second reason, stupid shooting mechanics, like, most of the time there will be trolls. In most races, or, you know, you can be shot. And uh, in most races, you will see trolls who just ride around and kill people for no reason. And the last reason is AFK people. They just stay there. But the main reason is horse races are actually not that fun. Because, you know, they are pretty slow. Horses in this game are pretty slow. No, it's not like cars in, in GTA Online, right? Because they are fast. No, they are slow. Anyway, Mike Dunn says, I've never done a single race. Yeah, I mean, a lot of people never actually even joined these races or, which is even more, uh, you know, common, they tried races, were disappointed and just, you know, stopped. Never, uh, never rejoined horse races again. And the, the, the thing is, this quadruple payout is not gonna change it. But the biggest problem is, it's just, you know, it's nothing. You're still not gonna earn money because it, it, another thing with races is they uh, end too fast. Yeah. Not gonna do a Michael Scott joke here, but you got my point. And finishing too fast... <laughs> In Red Dead Online is not a good idea because you're just not gonna get paid. Okay. Uh, Mr. Chimpo asks, uh, are horse masks seasonal thing or from passes? Uh, it's not a seasonal thing, it's from passes and unfortunately uh, there was no horse masks in a game for, for more than a year now. For more than a year now. So... There are a lot of people who, not even beginners, who high levels, but they don't have a horse mask and never had a chance to obtain it. So it's weird. Because, you know, people love horse masks. Not everyone, but a lot of people want to have a horse mask. Thomas Edward says, hey, ya uh, cat. Hey, ya. Uh, we are doing some weird stuff. Hey cat, which horse are you using? It's a uh, Turkoman horse. In my opinion, Turkoman are just beautiful. I mean, I should. I don't know why I have this mask right now equipped. I don't usually u love to use masks, and uh, in this mask, my Turkoman looks kind of stupid, a little bit. But you know, they're just beautiful. Snake Oil says, Harriet is angry with you. Okay, no, that's not true. Because you know what? This alligator is not dead. It's sleeping. J yeah, guys, just in case you jo joined the stream uh, and you don't know what's going on, I'm, dra I'm dragging this alligator to Tumbleweed and it's sleeping. I'm gonna wake him up and he's gonna be living in Tumbleweed. Because you know what? In Tumbleweed, it's pretty hot there. And uh, this alligator want to, to visit this beautiful city of Tumbleweed. Alex says, will we ever get a new update or this game is dead? We don't know for sure, but it doesn't look good, <laughs> unfortunately. Bravo116 Cinema says, horse masks are for people that have ugly horses. Yeah, I guess. Gabriel Griffin says, Cat, 
If you could take an educated guess, what would the next Red Dead Redemption 2 online consist of? Uh, I mean, if Rockstar will decide to not abandon this game, I'm pretty sure that at this point they already realized that people want to see robberies. So, in my opinion, if Rockstar will make an update, it has to be something connected, related to, you know, robbing banks. Why not? Not Ghana says, hey cat, what is your favorite bounty? Uh, Vir Virgil Edwards, Shepard, you know, in my opinion, is like the best uh, bounty mission in the game. It has replayability, it's kind of interesting. Uh, it's not that easy. So, yeah, I, li I like this. What is your favorite holiday to celebrate Red Dead Online? What, what do you mean? Uh, Mr. Chimpo says, I hope the next update would include houses and actual heists like Blood Man update. Well, we all hope for that. I mean, because this game definitely needs uh, properties and robberies. Pr pretty easy. Elaine Berg says, Hello, PewPiCat. Передай привет. Hello. It's Plasma says, are you playing on new Xbox? I feel like it runs better on Xbox than PlayStation. Hopefully they bring a next-gen patch. Uh, yeah, I'm playing on the new Xbox. It runs pretty good, but it's only 30 FPS even in Full HD. So yeah, I'm hoping for next-gen patch as well. But you know what? I need to make something clear. There is no way we're gonna receive next-gen patch for Red Dead Redemption 2. Because patch it's, you know, something free. And Rockstar will definitely try to sell next-gen version to us players. And yeah, it makes sense because we're gonna buy it. Uh, so what I'm saying, it's not gonna be a patch, it's gonna be if, it's, if it will be released someday, it's gonna be a next-gen version. Enhance it, enhance it and expand it, <laughs> something like that. Um, just like you know with GTA 5. Not Ghana says, why can't you go into banks in online? Because fun is not allowed. It's not allowed to have fun. Yeah, guys, uh, it's sleeping. Alligator is sleeping. Don't worry. It's fine. It's sleeping. You will see if I'm gonna actually deliver this alligator to Tumbleweed. You will see that it's sleeping. Danor Iron says hot air balloon update coming soon. You wish. Again, hot air balloons are just too fun. So no, you're not gonna you're not gonna see it. Samuel says one like equals one poor. And yeah, remember, no likes, no Tahiti. I actually wanted to check how many likes do we have. And it's 346 likes. Thanks to everyone who placed a like. And who used the super chat, because it's like a super like. Uh, Vinnible says, Red Dead looks nice on new Xbox, visually pl pleasing. Yeah, it's something I must uh, admit, and I said it many times, Red Dead Redemption looks pretty good on new, on next-gen console, like, really good. It's worse uh, than on my PC, uh, yeah, but, you know, it runs smoother, uh, but the problem is, Lock on 30 FPS. And you might say, well, why do you need like a 60 FPS? It's not a first person shooter, uh, whatever. But, you know, 
difference is noticeable, especially when you switch from playing in 60 FPS, for example, I play on the PC, and then I play on Xbox. You, you literally can see and feel the difference. Drifter Kid says, I would love to get World's first car in Red Dead Online at some point for car meat collection. Yeah. But again, it's not likely unless there will be some sort of, uh, um, let's say, tom time jump. So like one of the possibilities here they release red dead redemption one remake not remaster remake and they make like this red dead online 1911 and you jump to 1911 there there can be cars mike dunn using super chat thank you mike uh gonna go cat thanks for carrying on doing the streams mate Thank you for visiting the streams and supporting uh, me uh, via Super Chat. And have a nice day. And uh, yeah, guys, if I don't know, I don't know how many people are interested in this information. But if let's say you have to go and uh, you're not able to watch the full stream, but for some reason want to watch it later, it will be on the channel re recording. Of the stream will be on the channel so just saying i i pretty much never delete the streams they stay on the channel and for some reason you know it's actually hurting the channel because a lot of people aren't subscribing <laughs> because it's just statistics but still i think that it's cool to keep some uh anyway young young herb rule Young Hebrew says, hey cat, once you play at 60 FPS, there is no going back to 30. Exactly. Well, actually, you know what? It's you saying it like it's like a too ultimate form of uh, a statement because you're getting used to 30 FPS. It's true. At first you're like, oh, my eyes, my eyes after switching from 60 FPS to 30. But then you're getting used to it and it's like, yeah, it's fine. But once you're gonna switch to 60 FPS, try 60 FPS again, you will have the same effect. It's super hard to switch from uh, 60 FPS to 30. I mean, if you always played with 30 FPS, it's fine. But unfortunately, you know, switching uh, in uh, opposite direction from 60 to 30 is like not cool. Not cool at all. Okay, another NPC this time is ignoring me it's good but i'm i'm stuck a little bit anyway we go in okay hey uh bravo says hey cat show your road to tumbleweed I i'm not gonna open map because actually opening map is tricky uh when you drag in sedati sedated animals because animal might disappear while okay so the, the thing is how it works i have no idea why it works like that but it works like that when you're dragging a sleeping animal especially if you are in a different area you know you are in a in an area that this animal doesn't belongs to anyway if you're not watching the animal if you're not looking uh, at the, this animal directly it might randomly disappear so opening map and just you know losing uh, this animal from your line of sight is not a good idea it happened to me a few times because if you don't know uh, i i do this weird stuff sometimes dragging sleeping cows and alligators actually you know the most popular video on my channel it that almost has one million views it's uh, how i uh, brought alligator to the top of uh, the Mount Hagen. It's short, it's like one minute, funny music. Um, but yeah, I have some experience in, in this weird stuff.
Uh, Sun Breeze say, Hey, PewPewCat, what are you thinking about PvP build on controller with slow and steady and mousers? I'm, I'm not a big fan. I mean, if you're using slow and steady... I would rather go with some sniper rifle. Well, you know, it, it's actually... I still don't like it because, you know, you need to get pretty close to the target without painted black to make a kills with Mousers. Uh, yeah. I just, anyway, my point is, I don't... I, it's not something I would use. Anyway. Rizzle8876 uh, says, uh, Cat's lasso is more than reinforced. Yeah, it's a, it's a special lasso that you use to drag alligators. It's super reinforced. I'm not quite sure actually if I had to pick this specific road. I guess it would uh, be so much easier to pick a different road, you know, to cross uh, Great Plains. But anyway, let's follow the red line on a minimap. Drifter Kids asks, have you ever played one of the Sniper Elite games? Never. Never tried this. In Maybe, you know, I tried it at some point and played five minutes and dropped it. I'm not quite sure, but probably no. So probably I never even tried it. Slippery Bastard is the worst ability card. I would disagree, it's not the worst ability card. In some, in some situation, uh, especially on a console, it might, be, it might be even a good choice. But yeah, on a PC I don't really love, like Slipper, Slippery Bastard. Uh, on a console, it's a much better choice. But it, in any way, it's not the worst ability card. So, uh, like, much worse ability cards. Lord Garty says, Did you go on no pixel as an alien? I'm sure I remember you, bro. Hmm. <laughs> no. Uh oh. Your health core is empty. Uh oh. No, no, no. But we're not gonna, you know, dis not gonna be distracted by something as uh, health, empty health core. We gonna continue our journey because we need. To reach Tumbleweed. Oh no, 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 no. They might start shooting again, these people on this stagecoach. No. Okay, so can let's continue the journey. Guys are checking beans in the chat. Let's go. Alligators is swimming right now. Is it still alive? Yes. You know, there is a. You can look at the mini map to tell if an animal is still alive. You see, it's. Uh, uh, icon of this uh, alligator is red and it has this z z z, z like he's sleeping uh, so it's alive and it's just sleeping you can wake him up at any time if the icon will become black and there will be no this uh, letters it's, it will mean that it's you know unfortunately it's dead and that's why I'm going so slowly because if you uh, ride faster, there is a high chance that alligator 
or any other sleeping sedated animal will just die. Oh, my horse definitely is doing some hard, hard work here. You should bring sleepy alligator to Guarma. I wish we could travel to Guarma somehow. But we, but it's impossible, unfortunately. Okay, guys, I check in B in account. Okay, no, not again. It's kind of cool that, you know, they uh, they have weapons, but uh, they are not shooting me. But definitely these NPCs are unfriendly. Ben Milton says, those are some nice, nice horns on your horse. Horse? I thought it, I thought it's a deer. I mean, I bought a rideable deer. And you saying it's a horse? Oh no, I got scammed. Uh, Beaver says, what do you think is the best outfit for bounty hunter role? Uh, Toro good. Toro good. Toro Good is good. I usually use uh, this outfit. Toro Good outfit with Cossack's hat. Feed your horse, cat. No time, Julia. No time. We have more important things to do than feeding a horse. Oxwagon says, Hello, PvP cat. I haven't seen you for so long. Uh, how long ha... Uh, uh, how long have have you been doing it? I think one hour. Actually, yeah, let me check for how long we are dragging this alligator. So stream uh, is lasts for one hour and 11 minutes. And let's say I have spent like 10 minutes on catching alligator. So yeah, I guess one hour. Eh... Uh, Qisper says feed gator. Yeah, it's more important than feeding horse because But again, he's sleeping probably he's not that hungry, but we will see pretty soon Because we are getting closer. I mean, it's probably more than half of the way now So we're gonna get to tumbleweed relatively soon Don't forget to place a like if you for some reason love uh, people dragging sleeping animals yeah or maybe you enjoy this I remind you it's a it's a regular weekend streams of Red Dead Online recently for a month or so I, I make these streams regularly I don't know why. <laughs> I mean, the game is definitely dying. It's in a very bad state. Uh, less and less people play Red Dead Online, but we're still here, right? Are you in a public session? Yeah, I even saw like few people on a on a mini map. MA57 says, Red Dead Redemption vibes are amazing. I agree. I agree. And you know, on this stream you can see all the beauty of this world, of this open world, because I'm I'm, I'm riding pretty slow uh, today, dragging this alligator, and that's why we all can enjoy this beautiful open world. That alligator is snoozing hard. Yeah. Cat, what build do you recommend for a sniper player? Depends on, like, if you play in showdowns or in open world. In open world, I think the best one will be something with focus fire. So let's say uh, sharpshooter, focus fire, peak condition, and uh, some defense. I don't know. If, you know, if, for, for sniper versus sniper duels, uh, probably fool me once, fool me once would be good. Yeah, fool me once is a good choice here. 
But if you're playing in showdowns, I would rather use uh, some protection from headshots. So, I don't know. On a console, I, I usually use Slippery Bastard based builds, and on a PC, I was using Slow and Steady. Sometimes. Michael Ramirez says, Cat, what language do you use when you are thinking? I'm not, I'm not thinking. Why, wh why would I? What is your personal go-to revolver? Navy. Navy revolver. Navy revolver is... You know, it's, it has its vibes of uh, old spaghetti westerns for me at least i mean for me navy revolver is like number one and actually it's a good revolver lemai is also cool and pretty much if we're talking about you know effect effectivity effectiveness it's pretty much the same on the same level as navy it's the best choice but it looks worse in my opinion Garrett says, your streams are always interesting. I got the gold Turkoman because I liked yours so much. Yeah, Turkomans are so cool. I mean, I have a black Turkoman on a PC. It costs gold, but it also looks super awesome. Ben Milton said, that horse looks depressed. Lol, it needs food maybe. No, I actually tried uh, to feed it uh, previously and uh, nothing changed. So this horse is so depressed just because uh, it's doing a hard walk here. Oxwagon says, wait, is your horse Turkoman? Yeah, it's a chestnut Turkoman. This one is a chestnut Turkoman. And it has beautiful blue eyes. Like, really, really good looking. Killer Vic says, I must admit, you certainly stay true to your stream titles. Yeah. <laughs> I said I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna be dragon sleeping animal to tumble with, and that's what I'm gonna do. Michael Ramirez says, your horse is depressed because there is no new content in Red Dead Online. Exactly. My horse was expecting to see some, you know, at least new saddles. At least new saddles. But no. Your horse looks like Igor from Winnie the Pooh. But you know, it's tired, but it's doing its job. Not stopping, nothing, just does the job. It's something, you know, something cool. Vision says, no one is playing Red Dead Online. Every lobby I join is dead. Well, no, it's not actually works like that. Because, you know, it's peer-to-peer -peer connection and the like, size of the lobby is really limited. So even, let's say, if there will be only 1,000 players playing Red Dead Online, which is not the case. Uh, even if there will be 1,000 players, lobbies will still be pretty much the same size. But it's a completely different story if we're talking about showdowns, races, call to arms, yeah. There you can you can see like that Red Dead Online in, is not in the bad states. Cat, can I get your opinion on sandwiches? I love them. That's my you know expert opinion on sandwiches. Sandwiches are cool. Cat, your horse looks like Sarah Jessica Parker. I don't know why. 
I stopped playing Red Dead Online until they give double payout on collectible sets. Penny says, you know what, it's something that I was saying on many streams, but I was pretty sure that we gonna receive uh, some, you know, double or maybe even triple money on collectible sets in May. Because, you know, we haven't had a collector roll month uh, for quite uh, some time. <laughs> Lucas is making a joke. Uh, uh, yeah, so I was expecting to see a collector roll month. But no, instead we have uh, horse races. And I'm sorry, guys, that I'm maybe I'm ranting too much about this horse races month. But you know what? It's just a stupid idea. It's a terrible idea. First of all, payouts, even when they are quadruple, are not good for horse races. And even triple gold. I mean, it sounds like a joke. Triple gold. But you know, the trick is, most of open races, they, they end up in less than three minutes. So you get no gold at all. And triple gold, when you have zero gold, is still nothing. Yeah, there will be races that will take uh, more than three minutes and you will receive 0 0.24 gold, uh, gold bars. But it's gonna be not often. Anyway, my point is, even with triple gold, races is not the best way to grind gold. So, why? It's like a troll, says Ethan. Yeah, it's like it, it really looks like a trolling. Not only that, <laughs> there is a double money for stranger missions. And guess what? Even with double money, stranger missions are not good. I mean, you would rather go and grind uh, blood money missions. Or telegram missions. Okay, so it's... Uh, in this area, sometimes I'm getting attacked by wolves. So I'm gonna be careful. Tomash says, do you think we will get new races like last year in May? No, no, because you know what? No one cared about new races last year. What they need to do is not add new maps for races or new race types um, or giving additional money for horse races. They need to revoke horse races in general. Remove stupid weapons, like, completely. Uh, make horses different in races. Make races somehow fun. I don't know, maybe add mechanic from Red Dead Redemption 1. When you're running out of stamina extremely fast. You know, when you click into the button. Something like that. They need to rework it. Just a drift says people are the horse masks not in the game anymore. Uh, no, they are not in the game and for quite some time for I don't remember whether uh, if there were some horse masks in blood money update. I believe no. Uh, so if it's uh, if it's true last time we had horse masks in the game was uh, with uh, Bounty Hunters update in December 2020. Yo, Cat, do you think Breton is a good breed? Yeah, it, it's fine. I mean, it, it depends if you like how it looks. Okay. Ninja Squirrel 30. Slava Ukraine. Respect, Cat. Aloha, chat. Aloha, Ninja. Cat, did you give your horse a moustache? No, in my opinion, horse moustache looks just just terrible. Just really bad. It's a no. It, it's not even a no, it's like, no, God, no, please, no. So, yeah. I, I'm pretty sure none of my horses has... Um, Oh no, okay guys, I need to feed my horse. It's not cool. It's it's literally gonna die. It's not gonna die, it's not how it works, but you know. It, there, there was def definitely a time to feed a horse. 
some tips to make fast gold uh, unfortunately you cannot really make a fast gold but uh, watch out for daily challenges try to keep the streak running and uh, treasure maps don't ignore it I'm afraid they gonna attack me no luckily no that dude had a shotgun so it was kind of dangerous situation Eustus says, love videos like this. Keep up. <laughs> so it's, it's a stream, so it's not a video. I'm, I'm doing it live. But I mean, it, we, there is at least something to do for us high-level players in Red Dead Online, right? Dragon sleeping animals. You need to eat some beans. No, I'm gonna be fine. I'm gonna be feeding my horse. As for me, don't worry. Steven Bennett says, uh, Bounty Hunter treasure maps daily streak. Uh, well, it was a question for beginner, I guess. So, not Bounty Hunter yet. But you can grind blood money mission instead of Bounty Hunter missions. Actually, it's also fine. Christian says, that's a nice deer you're riding. Yeah, red deer. Yeah, it's, we are entering New Austin right now, so we are getting closer and closer to Tumbleweed. Let's go. Why are you wearing a black uh, t-shirt? It's not a t-shirt, it's a shirt. But I don't know. I love black t-shirts. My hair is black and I, I think it suits my look. Black t-shirts and shirts. Uh, Drifter Kid says, Bounty is more difficult, yet more fun than Collector. Uh, well, Collector has its own fun. Uh, not fun, but you know, it's, a, it's an immersive, especially for beginner. Like you uh, exploring the world. Yeah, for high level players, it's, it's a different story because you've been everywhere many times already but beginners you know it's a good excuse for a beginner to uh, watch around and enjoy different uh, places on the map how many players in the session right now there is usual you know it's usual amount gutters will attack npcs no i i tested it many times uh, even predators are not attacking NPCs and other animals in Red Dead Online. Gator might attack you, so let's say you uh, sedated, wake him up, and he might eat you. Not always, but sometimes, but never NPCs. Cat, do you ever eat uh, jolly beans? I guess. Why don't you sprint? Oh, nice, look. And you said that uh, Harriet is not gonna like me. But boom, daily challenge. Don't kill an animal for 22, 24 hours. Uh, so Ar Armata asks, why don't you sprint? If I will sprint, animal will die. So I need to, you know, to control the speed. Mr. Zombie says, should drag a bear to some area too. You cannot. Bear is too big uh, to drag it on lasso. S some animals you cannot drag with lasso, I believe. Maybe only legendary bear. I'm not quite sure, but I guess. Okay, some dude is... There are always someone <laughs> trying to... <laughs> Uh, some uh, some dude just met me. You saw it on the map. Oh no, it's following me. 
What is gonna what is gonna happen? What do you think? I'm not showing Oh no, Carly Bear flicked a hat at only PvP Cat. I'm not sure I was not showing because you know there are always stream snipers who jump at your lombi. But anyway, at least at least this person is not ignoring me. It's pretty cool because when I was uh, dragging an alligator to the top of Mount Hagen, I met actually like five people and uh, they were like either ignoring me or uh, just taking samples <laughs> from alligator. <laughs> okay, I'm not waving back uh, just because uh, mm, just because I don't want to release alligator. I, I'm afraid that he's gonna woke up when I will uh, remove lasso. But oh, nice! <gasps> no defensive mode. I pretty much never use defensive mode. Samuel says, "I bet that player knows who you are by your outfit." Actually, my nickname is only PvP Cat, so I guess it's not only outfit. Uh, but maybe, maybe. Uh, where do you take him? Or oh, her? Uh, we, we're not sure about the gender of this specific alligator. Anyway, I'm taking this alligator to Tumbleweed. If he kills alligator, what a waste of time it can be. Yeah. That, <laughs> that's exactly what's my point. Okay, I'm, I'm entering city. I hope NPCs are not gonna attack me in a city. M Manta says, what's the point of this? I mean, what, what do you mean? What's the point of life? It's too much of a philosophical question. I'm just dragging sleeping alligator all across the map because I like it. Okay. Bring it to the bar. <laughs> so alligator enters the bar. If, if gator dies, do you restart? Uh, if someone will kill my gator, uh, no, because, but if, if it will die for some other reason, who knows. Karo UK says, I tip my head at all real players, I pass whatever they are doing. Uh, just feels natural. I always use some emote that I have. Usually, right now I have this drinking emote. Uh, unless I'm busy with re making some, you know, recording some video or uh, just like now or on the stream. But yeah, I usually also react to other players. And let's go. But I mean, I, I really, you might rewatch that video, actually, there are two versions, one minute and like five minutes, something. Uh, when I was dragging a sleeping alligator to the top of Mount Hagen. Anyway, I met, first player I've met killed me, I, for no reason. I killed him back and just continued. Anyway, second player just ignored me, third one took sample from alligator and ran away. And also I, I met like, I believe two players in the mountains and they just ignored me completely. They just went by. It, it was kind of fun. Oh, we have 427 viewers. Hello, welcome. Welcome on the stream and almost 500 likes. So apparently people love watching me dragging sleeping alligators. It's not only me that weird. <laughs> because I, I actually, you know what, I've made quite a lot of uh, things like that, uh, dragon sleeping animals all across the map. I have no idea why, and I thought like, oh, it's only me that weird. But no, 
and almost 500 people placed a like. <laughs> uh, anyway, let's... But by the way, guys, about likes. If I'm if I'm talking about likes, just need to remind you that no likes, no Tahiti for this particular alligator. Okay. Cat, a weird question. Do you know what's the meaning of so sing song? No, I don't know. It's a weird question, I guess. Can you drag cougars in Red Dead Online? I'm not gonna make this typical cougar in your area joke, okay? I've done it. I've done it too much. Not not today. Not today. Uh, but if I remember correctly, yes, you can. You really can drag cougar. You cannot drag like the biggest animals, uh, grizzly. For some reason, you cannot drag boars. They are not that big, but you cannot lasso them when they are sleeping. Uh, bears, uh, boars, uh, these elks, big elks, moose, and that's it, if I remember correctly. Rest animals you can drag. Gilson Silva says, uh, hello, that's what we call a perfect transportation. Yeah, I, I might open my own, you know, delivery company. Delivering alligators all across the map. Contact per perfect every, every time, anytime, anytime. So... We are getting closer and closer to tumbleweed. Oh, uh, you know, people who live in tumbleweed will be definitely, definitely surprised. Free travel, lucky alligator. Yeah, I mean, uh, I'm delivering him to a much warmer uh, place. Angry Aussie says, you should drag an alligator to the bridge and send it flying. Well, maybe, maybe I will the other day. He's on a vacation. Yeah, he, I mean, this alligator is lucky because a lot of people are joining in stream and saying, oh no, poor alligator. First of all, he's, he's just sleeping. I mean, imagine, he was sitting close to Harriet and I'm, I, 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 I guarantee you, he is ha or, or she, I don't know, again. But this alligator hates Harriet. Like, just like everybody else. Anyway, then boom, sedative ammo, boom, he's sleeping, and he will woke up in a completely different uh, area. It's like a dream vacation. He's fine. Are you playing on a PC? No, I'm not playing on a PC. I'm playing on Xbox Series X. Bring alligator to Tahiti, Dutch Wanderlinde is saying. And for Dutch Wanderlinde, um, like everyone should go to Tahiti. I wish I could. I wish I could bring this alligator to at least Guarma. Why no PC? Hackers? Yeah, at some point uh, it was completely impossible for me to play on a PC and especially to stream. And uh, since uh, since then, I switched to Xbox. And yeah, situation with uh, modders is better now. Not much, but a little bit. Uh, at, le at least you can stream safely. Because previously, you know, every mod menu user could just crush you simply by... No, 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 no. Simply by knowing your... Uh, name that's it now it's harder but still not safe hey cat what is your alligator's uh name uh his name is siegfried 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 the alligator 
It's my friend. Yeah. Let's go, let's go, guys. Drag him in the bar at Tumbleweed. You know what? Actually, it's something that I'm gonna do. I'm gonna drag this alligator to the bar at Tumbleweed. Molden School says, Siegfried. Exactly, Siegfried. Do you play fighting games? Sometimes I play Mortal Kombat. Not, 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 not too often. I'm not, I'm, I'm terrible at fightings. Like, really. I'm generally, like, at least mediocre at pretty much every games that I play. At some, I'm, like, naturally good. I don't know why. But at fightings, bruh, terrible. Uh-oh, someone is waiting for me. Not a good sign. Not a good sign. Uh... Okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna say that it, it looks weird, because, I, you know, I'm dragging a sleeping alligator. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna say it looks weird. <laughs> oh... Uh, what a funny stream we have today in this dying abandoned game, right? <laughs> uh, we're getting so close, so close to Tumbleweed. Ah, it's, it's stuck. Come on. And stuck. For some reason, sometimes these animals, they just stuck uh, in, in textures, I guess. <laughs> Molden Skull says a weird, weird West. Exactly. It's really weird. <laughs> just a Rift says, just your normal Sunday. Yeah, I mean, why not? <laughs> yeah, it's a good one, dude. I mean, the, the player who was making these moves, respect. You you got the vibes of, of this game, I must admit. 456 players watching, welcome, uh, place a like if you enjoy weird stuff, and we gonna continue, getting close to Tumbleweed. <laughs> uh, we are doing it, I mean, I mean, I'm pretty sure that by this time we are in, in our run for almost two hours, we have another, oh, I'm pretty sure, okay, from from this uh, from this outfit i can tell you for sure that this person knows who i am <laughs> i mean it's an outfit that i use all the time it's a nice protection guys let's go let's go i, I call this uh, outfit um how do i call oh assassin cossack it's a cat clone. Yeah, actually, dude, even character looks like mine. Really? Uh oh, NPCs again. Hope they're not gonna start shooting because I repeat, we are we are super close to Tumbleweed already. Really close. Imagine if it was a bison. Eben says, yeah, exactly. Uh, thanks for reminding me. Another animal that you cannot drag on lasso is uh, this buffaloes. Oh, dog. D I like how dog is like acting normal. And and these people are in the middle of this ranch. They are like, oh, whatever. Nice day. I'm standing there smoking. Some dude dragging alligator. Well, nah, fine. Chicken boy says somewhat close. Yeah, we are doing it. Can we take a selfie in Tumbleweed? Sure, sure, guys. We will make a selfie. Uh, 
close to sleeping gutter. So everyone who follows me, uh, feel free to join this selfie. Is this gutter still asleep from just one sedative? You see how it works. When you sedate an animal, it will not wake up if it has lasso on it. So it will sleep like forever. Uh, uh, but when you release this lasso, it wakes up in like one minute or so. Yeah, we will we will make a picture in tumbleweed. Okay, I I I need to slow down because I'm afraid this alligator is kinda can die if I will run right too fast. Okay. Okay, so, okay, hope, I was afraid, you know, it would be super fail if there was a train and it would hit an alligator. Cat, how would I be able to join your game? I have no idea how they joined my game, uh, so I'm not gonna tell you, because I don't know. Hey, Cat, next time drag a human. Unfortunately, you cannot... Uh, drag a human without human dying if i remember correctly even if you're gonna go pretty slow uh it seems like uh, npc is dying guys we are technically we are in a tumbleweed already i think Could you drag a bear from tall trees to Saint Denis? No, uh, because you cannot. Maybe legendary. I will check it because if I remember correctly, you can lasso pretty much every single legendary animal. But I might be wrong. We will. I will test it. You know. <laughs> Tribuchet says, can I volunteer to be dragged in the next stream? Yeah, so you see, people are even jealous to this alligator. And you are saying like, oh no, why are you why are you so cruel with alligator? No, alligator is super fine. Everyone wants to, to have such a free ride to tumbleweed from Saint Denis. I mean, imagine how much it would cost to him. Okay, for some reason we stuck again. Hey, horse, let's go. Let's go. Okay, here we go. I don't know, for sometimes <laughs> Max says uh, just don't give uh, uh, drinks to secret in bar just in case. Yeah. I mean, he might go uh, you know, why become violent. Secret. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh no, what what someone took a sample. What this is no That was weird. I mean have you seen it? It's a it's a teleportation. Ah, uh, I hope I will. Yeah, foof. So someone was was taking a sample from <laughs> from an alligator. <laughs> oh boy, it's fine, guys. Don't worry, alligator is fine. Yeah, it's it, we are. I repeat, we are super close. It's how it works because it's uh things like sleeping animals because yeah, again it's not a dedicated server it's peer-to-peer -peer server and because of that in red dead online uh so you might see a different picture than other players talking about uh animals talking about npcs talking about uh other players actually was a stay so not again He's stuck again. Okay. Okay, we're, we're almost in tumbleweed. We're almost there. Well, re remember guys, we will have to... We will have to make a picture. Close to the bar. 
How long have you been dragging your alligator from Lagra? Uh, I think around uh, what? No. What? 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 Huh? How? What? What was that? He just disappeared. Have you seen it? Oh no! It's nowhere around. It just disappeared. Uh. Oh! What, what what happened? I was looking on it. He's back there. Where? Where? I don't see it. It really looks like it just disappeared. Oh boy. It's because of peer-to-peer -peer session, uh, because of peer-to-peer -peer connection. Maybe he's somewhere. Oh, there, there, there he is, there he is. Don't, 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 don't touch him. It's fine, it's fine, guys, there he is. Yeah, yeah, see, fine. He just teleported. Oh, yes! 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 Place a like if you love this happy ends. Everyone was like, oh no, including me. Uh, but again, it's just because of how Red Dead Online servers work. Okay, so... Nah, 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 auto-aiming, don't go like this. Okay, let me get on the horse. And we gonna... Hey. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Cool. And we are on our journey again. It's a big victory. Win. You see how it how it works. It's really weird because if there are few different uh, people in the area, game starts to do weird stuff because for some players, uh, location of this gutter is here, for example. And for others is in a different uh, place. 600 likes, Kairu says. Thanks to everyone who placed a like. You know what? I, I you know what I decided on this uh, regular weekend uh, streams. We're gonna be doing weird stuff until Rockstar will release. Uh, an update or I will give up on Red Dead Online because you know what if there will be no updates this year uh, who knows <laughs> who will stay playing it but so far I have a plan on this weekend streams usually they happen on Sundays we're gonna be doing something like this something weird okay so I hope this time it's not gonna repeat so easy now Easy now. Easy. How you know how how uh, John uh, Arthur Morgan is saying like easy. Bo <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> just a normal day in tumbleweed. <laughs> it's just dude just fall off the roof. Oh. <laughs> okay here we go guys uh, everyone who's in a session with me let's go we have a we have a picture so first of all achievement unlocked we are in tumbleweed so technically job is done but it's not done yet because we also need to make a picture then get alligator to the bar and only then wake him up okay <laughs> okay, Dutch Wanderlinde says you 
even have a better plan than me. Exactly. It was a great plan to get alligator to tumbleweed and we did it. We did it. Rick Grimes is here just casually drinking. And let's go. Uh, you have a twin following you. Yeah, it's like my twin in uh, Torogood, in Torogood costume. Or I should rather say clone. Clone. It doesn't sound like clone, I guess. Because clone is like a clown. And I was talking about clone. Redskin says legendary cat stream. Okay, so we are get going to saloon. Everyone gets here. Dog bill. <laughs> Dog just ran over the alligator. I mean, it's so stupid. Oh, let's go. Let's go to the saloon. Here we go. So everyone, go here, and we gonna make a picture. Okay, so something weird is going on. Can I make a picture from here? Actually, I can, which is kind of weird. I, I, I even can make a self-portrait. Ah, your camera is full. I hate it. But anyway, let's, let's make a picture. It's gonna be on the stream, right? <laughs> it's a good one. Samuel says, Hail Siegfried one alligator. <laughs> yeah, Secret and Friends. This uh this is called Secret and Friends. This picture. Woohoo! Now let's get alligator to the bar and uh, wake him up. Okay, guys. No, 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 no. I want to catch alligator. Let's go. Oh, no. Nah. I forgot that uh, when... You know, when you when you ride in a horse, you need... Uh, you don't need to press uh, uh, RT all the time. But when you walk in, you have to... <laughs> piano guy, like, look look at the piano guy. He's like, oh, alligator. Whatever. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Anyway, time to wake up alligator to show you that he's fine and 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 he was uh, awake all the time. Coma cut using super chat. Thank you, thank you, coma cut. So now, now we have a party, like me, alligator. Oh no, dude, why why you running away? <laughs> Let, let's see where he's gonna go, where he's gonna go. Okay, so a lot of weird dudes are just following alligator. Let's... <laughs> he said, nope. <laughs> Big Donnie says, yeah. He's going somewhere. He's probably, he's confused. I mean, he was sleeping and like... Where the hell am I? Can the ga uh, gutter play poker? It's a good question, I guess. He should. But he will be a fish. You know, it's a joke that only poker players will understand. But I'm still making it. <laughs> now, he's, now he's on the run. Let's see where he's gonna go to. <gasps> yeah, he's getting stalked. He, he don't know where his swamp is. Yeah, Randy Page, I agree. He... <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Now I'm afraid he's gonna attack someone. Boor, boost your course. Yeah, it's a good idea. Let's eat some beans. Nice beans. Was it beans? 
No, it's it's not a beans. Let me eat beans. Bean party. It's kind of interesting that he's not attacking players. Because I, I, I was sure that he's gonna attack, uh, attack us once he will wake up. Where is he? Oh, I was, I was checking. Oh, there he is. Oh no, he, he killed that dude. Oh no. Actually, he cannot talk, people. <laughs> so, <laughs> press F. Let's let's make it. <laughs> he's actually he he he's a angry, quite angry right now. <laughs> While I was pressing F, he ran away. Oh, there he is! There he is. Gather needs fooded. Oh, uh, it's uh, probably the weirdest stream I had in a long time. Probably the weirdest. <laughs> but don't worry, next week is gonna be even. <laughs> I don't know why he attacks someone, but other players he just ignores. Bring him to a river. Unfortunately, I'm afraid he's gonna die if sedated again. Uh, but let's try. Let's try to bring him to a river and see what he's gonna do. I need a horse. No, 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 no. Don't attack me, bro. Yeah. So now he's sleeping. Anyway, now from here, let's go to San Luis River. Right here. Where is my horse? I actually was not expecting that we will be able to bring uh, Gutter to Tumbleweed, but it happened. So now let's, you know, obviously Gutter wants to go to Mexico. And unlike players, I think Gutter can go to Mexico. I hope, at least. I hope so. So yeah, let's go. It's, uh, you know, it's uh, no, platinum. We're completing this challenge to... This mini game for a platinum. Yeah, here we go. It's my gutter move, dude. Yeah. So gutter wants to go to Tahiti. So you know. I don't know why horses just stays on watch. Is this fun game? Orion asks. No, it's a boring horse game. Everyone knows it. So, yeah. And we go in. We are going to the river. <laughs> um. <clears throat> Explode the gutter at the end of the stream. No, why would I do that? It's a, it's a cruelty. No, we, you know, we wish only the best to this gutter, so that's why we brought him to Tumbleweed, but, to Tumbleweed Saloon, but apparently he was not happy in Tumbleweed Saloon, and you know why, because gutters, they live in, a, in water, so now we gonna, you know, somehow deliver this gutter to water. It's like a bonus, bonus material. How they join you? I have no idea, actually. Apparently, when um, when people see someone's in a lobby with me, uh, they just jump on uh, this other person. I guess that's how it works. Cat. Cat is a new Florida man. 
I, I don't know. What do you mean? He doesn't drink beer, Rebecca says. Yeah, probably that's why he decided to leave that bar. Danor says, people are getting too rambunctious. Might not make it to the river. Yeah, it's something that might happen. Uh, because, you know, when uh, there are a lot of people in lobby, everything could happen. But so far, everyone is polite. I am going fire, says. Hi, Cat. Hi, hello to you. Welcome on the stream. Actually, it's it's not that far from uh, from tumbleweed to the water, so I guess in like ten minutes we will make it. And meanwhile, Galil is redeeming like yeah, guys, it's a beans plus super system by watching streams, by communicating in chat, uh, by using super chat. You are receiving these beans, which are basically points to redeem some stickers during during streams. Mr. Frosty Games HD says, "Hello, cat. Hello to you, cat. You have half the server with you." Michael says, uh, <clears throat> "Well, is that exactly how it works? I was trying to, you know, figure out how this peer-to-peer -peer system works." It's not really how you think it is. So it's not like there is a server, uh, let's say. So it's not like you are in the same lobby with people who are in Saint Denis at the same time. It's interesting, but it's how it works. So uh, area is like a separate lobby. There are exceptions, but... Uh, it's really weird. It's, first of all, it um, jumps all the time between lobbies. So let's say if someone of uh, our crowd stayed in Tumbleweed, he might not be in the same lobby with us anymore. Randy Page says, Gator, where are you? I'm so worried. Gator, Gator is here. He's going, he's going to the water. It's gonna be our... You know, ultimate journey. We we are going it. How your cat doing, cat? Gabe Gray says I'm gonna show my cat at the top of the stream. He's living with his uh, he, with his with my grandma and uh, eating healthy. No, actually unhealthy. Unhealthy a lot. MA57 says, it would be good if uh, they added bigger map or like other cities. If they will add Mexico, someday map will be much bigger. But I mean, map is pretty big uh, anyways, uh, already. Moonshine production complete and it was complete like long time ago. Cat, what horse do you use the most? Uh, just Drift is asking. Uh, this one. So it's um, Turkoman. Or Shire. Would you prefer Mexico or Canada map expansion? Uh, Mexico. I mean, Mexico has this awesome Western vibes. New Austin also, but Mexico especially. Okay, so Gator is still sleeping. It's fine. Don't worry. We are getting closer. Closer and clo- Not again. Not again. Okay, let's search for the Gator. Gator, where are you? Siegfried. Siegfried, my bro. Where are you, dude? Oh, no. That's usually the problem of big lobbies, you know, when there are a lot of people. 
that it, it starts walking unstable. But yes, it seems like this time we lost Gator forever. It's teleported back to his swamp. Let's go, Gabriel says. Gator is back. And where is it? Where is it? Where is Gator? I don't see him. Maybe someone sees uh, the Gator, but... I'm afraid that it's gone. The problem is I don't see him on minimap anymore. Yeah, so somehow he's teleported back to uh to to his swamp in Sandani. It's magic. It's it's I, I tell I'm gonna tell you it said which uh Harriet did it. He somehow made this voodoo schmoodoo stuff and teleported my gutter back to to the swamp. Yeah. I blame uh Harriet for this. I really think it's something she did. You automatically switched lobby. Yeah, is that that was something I was telling you? It's something that happens because of this peer-to-peer -peer, uh, lobbies. You just uh, auto switch lobby, especially when there are a lot of people in the same area or close. Yeah, it was Harriet. I'm telling you for sure. Anyway, uh, Secret uh, visited Tumbleweed like he always wanted to, like he always wanted to. And uh, he, I mean, he wanted to wizard Tumbleweed, but... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Every time someone took a sample, it made a glitch. Maybe, maybe it's not uh, related to samples at all. <laughs> Uh, but anyway, guys, uh, thank you for visiting this stream. We had a goal to, del <laughs> to deliver gutter to Tumbleweed. We did it. Tumble uh, visited Tumbleweed, and here we are. Okay, let me let me actually make an emote that I'm usually doing in such situation, just drinking. So yeah. Uh, we had some conversations about Red Dead Online and stuff like that. So who knows, maybe next stream we will also do something weird and, and on the background. Or challenging or something. Anyway, because you know, if we will have no topic to discuss, anyway, at least something at the background should be fun. And thanks to everyone who joined. Thanks to everyone who placed a like, to everyone who was using Super Chat, and to all my Patreon supporters. And obviously to all these guys in a session uh, for not <laughs> oh boy, for not ruining and killing my gutter. Yeah, let's make a photo. Yeah. Guys, stay here. We try we we tried to make a photo and this happened. So apparently, Pico Dog using super like as uh, super chat, no likes, no Tahiti, thanks. So you know there will be no photo because when there are more than five people in Red Dead Online at the same time, always uh, some fighting begins. But hey, oh, let's make a photo pretty fast. Okay, self portrait. I need to stay like this. Micah killed you. Sounds like so. So here we go. Here we go. Just random people hanging in tumbleweed. Oh, everyone, everyone, go get here. Let's make a photo. I I'm gonna wait for a photo. But yeah, <clears throat> with that being said, this photo will be an end of the stream. Uh, so thank you again for visiting, and. Uh, 
stay healthy and stay safe. Let's make a photo. Not, not like you can see everyone on this photo because, I mean, this horse, for example, is not showing. Okay. Bam. Made a photo. Your camera is full. I will clean my camera for the next stream. But so far, good job. Thanks for everyone uh, for visiting. See you next time.